Hello everyone, Ryan here. Hell or High Water. Hell or High Water stars Chris Pine and Ben Foster. And they play brothers, also known as Toby and Tanner Howard. And they essentially just play these brothers who decide to rob a bunch of banks. Well, I guess technically a chain of banks which are pretty much owned by the same bank that is about to foreclose on their ranch. And it's actually kind of poetic in a way. I mean, I think so. The fact that they rob, they rob the very bank that is about to foreclose on the ranch, make them homeless. Um... Of course, I don't want to give away too many details because I prefer I prefer the majority of my movie reviews to be spoiler-free. And, and that's mostly because, you know, especially I know how it feels to have a movie spoiled. Uh, but I will say this movie is definitely interesting. It does have kind of a slow start. In fact, I would say maybe the first 20 to 30 minutes is a slow start. But even that, even in the beginning of the movie, it it provides uh, some interesting backstory. Um, not too much, but uh, just a little bit, just enough. Uh, mostly it just, you know, focuses on the re- relationship between these, uh, these two brothers. And, of course, it does take place in uh, Texas. And... You can tell that right away. Uh, I will say that some of the, I guess, uh, towns depicted in this movie uh, are very much, definitely very indicative of various small Texas towns. Um, I mean, personally, I live in El Paso, Texas, um, but I have been to a lot of other uh, towns throughout the states and so I'd say in that regard they definitely got that right uh, the story is also very well written and the acting is definitely good uh, Jeff Bridges is also in this he plays um, he plays this detective guy who is uh, about a week or so away from retirement and he does everything he can to track them down and make sure they don't rob any more banks and all in all, it's very interesting. Uh, I would say if you do like to watch movies about bank robbing, but especially if you like movies that have a good story and all of that, but depict uh, depict the relationship between two brothers in a in a very realistic way. It's not you know it's not just purely them getting along all the time. Uh, they do have some conflict between each other. And that's very realistic. And I like that that was shown in this movie. Because I guess I kind of expected that, you know, it was just going to be like a typical just nothing but action, you know, action kind of movie. Uh, There is a lot of action in it, definitely. But that's not the main point of this movie. Ultimately, I do give it 9 out of 10 tamales, 9 out of 10 Yeah, I highly recommend watching it at least once. And that'll do it for this review. A review of Hell or High Water. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And as always, until next time, keep it real, keep on rocking, and peace.